Okay, when doing this, uh, you'll have a benzene ring. Okay, and then you're going to have a director on there. So benzene as itself, like this, there's no director on there. There's no ortho, para, meta director. Um, if I put, you know, a branch on here, so let's say Cl2, uh, AlCl3. So if I put chlorine on there, now I have a director, okay? Chlorine is my director. Okay, so it's not until you have a branch on there that you, that you actually have something directing. Now let's do another reaction. Let's uh, let's put I don't know uh, HNO three H two S O four. Okay, now this is going to put um, NO two on there. Now, where would it go? So you need to think, what type of director is chlorine? I kind of made a chart there. So this is a halogen, so this is a special one. So this is deactivating halogen. Oh, sorry, it's, it was freezing a bit. So halogens are deactivating. This just, deactivating just means it's making the benzene ring less reactive. So benzene, equals less reactive. Okay, and so it's deactivating, but it's also ortho para by itself, okay? So this puts on NO2. This is not your director. Your director is the branch coming off benzene, okay? So this is ortho para, okay? So you would have your chlorine here, and then your answer will be one ortho, so you'll have one NO2 right here, plus one para. And para is always opposite of it, NO2. Okay, now let's look at some other examples. Okay, let me think. Uh, well, let's look at NO2 as a director. So let's start with benzene. Okay, right now there's no director on there. So let's put one on there, HNO3, NO2. Now right now I can put this anywhere. So let's just go crazy here. And let's, let's put it over here. Why? Because I can. All of these spots on here are the same. If there's no director, that means you can put it anywhere on there. There's not a wrong answer. If you don't believe me, try it on sapling, and you'll get the right answer no matter where you put it, as long as there's not a director. But now there's a director, okay? Uh, this, this right here is your director, okay? My first branch on there. Okay, so uh, this, let's look on here. So I have nitrogen on there. Nitrogen is what's actually bonded. And let me draw this better. It looks like, okay, here's benzene. I'll just put B for benzene. And then I'm going to have plus, minus. Now, look, what is the atom directly coming off benzene? Okay, and I'm going to look, that is nitrogen. Okay, so I'm comparing everything to nitrogen here. Okay, now that I know, like, I, I guess I'll call it my central atom. So my central atom is nitrogen, which is the one directly coming off benzene. Now I see what, um, what is coming off of that. And I don't count benzene. I don't care about benzene anymore, so it's not really in the picture. I'm looking at what's um, going past benzene. So I'm looking at oxygen and oxygen in this case. Is oxygen more electronegative than nitrogen? And by electronegativity, basically, what's closest to fluorine on the periodic table? And if you look, oxygen is closer to fluorine. Electronegativity just means loves electrons, okay? Oxygen um, is more electronegative. It likes electrons more. So it's going to pull electronegativity towards it, okay? So this means, okay, if, if your central atom is, so I'm going to put central atom equals not most electronegative, not most 
electro neg. Okay. See how nit the nitrogen is bonded to something more electronegative, so it's not the most electronegative. So this is a deactivator. Okay, so that means it's going to make benzene less reactive than just benzene by itself. Okay, and it's going to be a meta director. Okay, so now let's put something else on there just to show. Um, Br2FeBr3, okay? So this is the new group I'm putting on there. So this is not the director. This is just the new reaction. The director is this right here. And I said it was a meta director, so I'm going to put it on meta. So here's my NO2, and then meta would be right here. Okay, uh, let's look at the ortho paras then. Uh, let me think of one. Okay, let me just put a, this on there. Okay, so CH3Cl, ALCL3. And this is just going to put a methyl on there. Okay, now let's test this one out. Okay, so here's my benzene. Here's my carbon. Here's the three hydrogens coming off. Okay, so here's my central atom, carbon here. This is the one directly coming off benzene. Now let's see if it's bonded to something more electronegative. And we're looking at hydrogen, hydrogen, or hydrogen. Okay, neither of those are more electronegative than carbon. Okay, so this is going to be an activator because it's the most electronegative, so it, the electronegativity goes this way, it's gonna go towards the central atom. And it's going to be an ortho para director, okay? So let's put another group on here. Um, uh, let's see, S3H2SO4, okay. So here's my methyl group. Now this is an ortho para director, so I'm going to put one ortho, so so 3H, and then one para, so 3H. Okay, and and that's how it goes. So you're looking at your central atom and, and comparing uh, what it's bonded to. So let's look at let's just look at some of these. Let me think of one. So let's just, these are all coming off benzene. Okay, so let's put my benzene and let's look at SO3H. Okay, so uh, see, this would be a sulfur, oxygen, like this. Okay, and now look at this. Is sulfur the most electronegative? The answer is no, because oxygen is more electronegative than sulfur, is closer to fluorine. Okay, so this would be a meta director. Uh, let's look at uh, bromine. Okay, bromine has a halogen, so it's its own special group. Okay, where these are always ortho para directors. Uh, let's look at another one. Let's do C double bond O, I don't know, H. Okay, my central atom here is carbon. Is it bonded to something more electronegative? Yes, right here, okay. So this is a meta director. But let's compare this to maybe this. Let's do, uh, here's my benzene. So let's do like a CH2, CH2OH, okay. Now what would this be? This is a little trickier, okay. Now you're tempted to say, I think anyways, that this is a meta director because there's a carbon here, but there's something more electronegative. But do you see that this oxygen, it's not bonded to this carbon, okay? It's not bonded to that carbon at all. There's no bond to this carbon. It's bonded to this carbon. Is that the atom directly coming off benzene? No, that's this atom right here. 
make sure you realize it's this atom right here. This is my central one. There's no oxygen coming off here, okay? So this is actually an ortho para director. Now let me also, let me bring up one last thing. Let's look at like the synthesis. So if we start with benzene, and we're trying to make this, okay? So chlorine and an NO2 on there. So let's just think, how do we put NO2 on there? So we would put this, let me change my color. This one goes on there. Okay, so yeah, you would, oops, sorry, uh, HNO3, H2SO4, and then how do you put chlorine on? That would be a Cl2, AlCl3. Okay, so now I know how to put them on, okay, and that's not the hardest part. The hardest part, you know, because you could just look at a list of reactions there. The hardest part is figuring out which one you put on first, okay? So what you do is you look at how far apart they are in the product, okay? So we're comparing the product here, okay? Do you see that they're one, two apart, okay? Which one is it ortho, meta, or para that has one, two? And the answer is ortho. So that means to get these one and two apart from each other, you need an ortho director to go on first, okay? Uh, because that's how it was directed. If they're one, three, okay, so remember one, two equals ortho. One, three is meta. One, four is a uh, para. So if you get one, two, or one, four, Whenever you look at the product, so comparing product, okay, then you need to put your ortho para on there first. If you get a 1, 3 comparing them, then you need to put the meta on there first, okay? So now I decide which one is my ortho para director. I look over here, nitrogen, is it uh, bonded to something more electronegative? Yes, it's bonded to oxygen, so this is a meta director, meta. Let me change this. this is a meta. Okay, chlorine is a special case. It's a halogen. Okay, and this was a ortho para. Okay, so I, that means I need to put chlorine on first. So then I already know how to put them on. I already said. So I, I all I need to do is put Cl two, AlCl three, and then second, then I need to put HNO three. H2SO4. Okay, so try the logic out with some of the other ones I worked out in the podcast and make sure you can um, figure all of those out. And there's a list of reactions that should be listed under uh, the chapter 17 handouts.